The COVID-19 vaccine and flu vaccine are different, and it's safe to get both vaccines at the same time. So don't hesitate. Vaccinate. The Pike County Health Department reminds you that the strongest defense is vaccination against flu and COVID. In 2020, when COVID restrictions limited funeral attendance to immediate family, locals from Letcher County formed the Lower Letcher Freedom Flag Waivers to honor fallen veterans. It was started when COVID first came about. Uh, visitation at the funeral homes was restricted to f immediate family. So we just decided to, a few of us decided to get together and set up by the roadside and just hold the flag for the veterans as the funeral went by. The group was formed early one morning to honor a veteran of ISOM at his funeral procession held later that day. The group continued to grow and set up at veterans' funeral processions to honor them for their service. We don't want any self-recognition. It's not about us. It's, it's about the veteran and the veterans' families. We try to be there set up, rain, snow, or whatever, because our veterans didn't get to pick a nice, warm, sunny day when they were defending our country. So we try to, that's one way we can give them honor. Is, is to be there no matter the weather. The motto for the Lower Letcher Freedom Flag Waivers is let us serve the veterans who served us. We would like to see this take off in other communities. Other people start something like this and you know where they live. It's no big deal. I mean it's, it's, it don't cost anything to do it other than a little bit of time uh, and a little bit of dedication. Uh, just contact some of your friends and say hey would you like to help honor this veteran that, that passed away. If you have any questions about starting a flag waving group or would like to donate a flag, you can contact Jim Adams on Facebook. For Mountaintop News, I'm Brianna Robinson.